Hello everyone, this is step six of building a gaming PC. So for step six, six, we're going to install the storage. So all we do for this is you get your hard drive and your SSD. So your hard drive, depending on what kind of case you have, you will uh, screw it into the case itself or into a bay and then slide it into the case. For this case, we actually screw it into the back of it. And as you see here, mine can either go on the back right there or underneath under where it is right now but i decided to put it on the back so you're just going to screw it in with the screws that it that the hard drive comes with and after that you're practically done with the hard drive for now after you're finished uh screwing in and um setting in the hard drive in place you are then going to install your ssd if you have one that is and for this case again you're going to have a dr uh, a bay that you screw it into and then screw into the computer. For this case, there is two slots that we have, but I chose to do the top one. So you just unscrew it, and once you have it unscrewed, you take your SSD and you screw your SSD into the bay itself. So when you do this, make sure that the arrow on the SSD is facing the right way, because if it isn't, you'll have to unscrew it and then put it back in the other way for the SATA cables to connect to the motherboard correct, or you will you won't be able to connect them because it's facing the wrong way. So after you have the SSD screwed into the bay, which you'll get those screws with the SSD, uh, you're just going to put the uh, SSD in the, and the bay back into the PC where you got it, and then you're just gonna screw it back into place with a screw or whatever was holding it in place. So after you finish um, screwing that in, you're then going to connect, to connect the actual SATA cables themselves to the uh, storages. These are what allocate the storage to the motherboard and to the everything. Basically what connects the two. So that is the SATA cable right there. You're going to plug it into both the hard drive and the SSD. And then from there, you're going to plug it into the motherboard. Now, when you plug it into the SSD and the hard drive, there's only one s connector that will allow that, and it's pretty self-explanatory. It's You just plug it into the bottom for the hard drive, as you can see, and the SSD you plug into the side. Now, when you go to plug it into the motherboard, depending on where the SATA cables are on your motherboard, that is where you'll plug it into. For mine, they were on the side next to the power connectors, so you're just going to plug it into there, and that's it. So that was step six of building a gaming PC.